If you clicked on this video because you want dirt about Drum Workshop, I'd click away right now because that's not what I'm here to do. I'm just here to tell you uh, why I'm walking away from Drum Workshop. And I'm probably not going to tell you the whole story because some of it's just personal information, not dirt. I started with Drum Workshop when they had only five endorses. That was way back, right after I think I won action, quite honestly, I started to talk to them. I was with Pearl at the time. I went out there with my Pearl drums for DW to do the edges and fell in love with what they were doing. And I went with them and I didn't look back for 15 years until I started building my own drums and I stayed with the hardware and the pedals. And then when I got sick and I came out of being sick, I did not restart Rocket Drum Works, my drum company. It was just too daunting of a task. I just didn't want to get back into that. I wanted to get back into getting Poison on track. Um, so I just started using the DW drums again too. But things have changed and they're rapidly changing at Drum Workshop. And this is not about Roland because I think there's changes whether Roland's in the picture or not. Uh, if you don't know, Roland bought DW out and they've partnered with them in a way, but uh, they do own them. They're going to be making probably some stellar, uh, spectacular electronic hybrid kits, I'm sure. But the reason I'm walking away from Drum Workshop is just because I'm ready to explore different avenues, really. Uh, after all this time, it's just time. Give some newer guys a chance to come in and uh, play their drums, because they're great gear, man. Great gear, great hardware, great pedals. Uh, really great people that work and build this stuff. Now let somebody else get in there and play this stuff for a while and represent it. Some younger blood, you know? So where I'm landing is not where I thought I would land. I thought I would probably land at a USA legacy company or a custom boutique company. And I've done neither of those two things. I'm with one of the bigger companies. And the reason I'm doing that is because Poison is a business and I need to get on the road and have gear that is reliable. Not just the gear, but the people behind it. And so that's what my choice is about uh, and why it's my choice. I have other things I do too. I have a side band and I, I just have a lot of things I want to do that I have to rely on. And there's some great companies out there. But like I said, I didn't land where I thought I would land. I am really, really excited, but I'm not going to tell you today. Before you get upset at me, I can explain why. The reason I'm not is because there's a few little contractual things that I'm just having to get out of the way. I'm 99.9% .9 sure it's fine. But before I do that, before I make an announcement, I want to make sure all that stuff's taken care of. I'm actually sitting at a kit from this drum company. I barely touch the tuning. <laughs> it sounds amazing. I'm really excited to play this gear. I really like the people over there so far. And it's going to be a really great experience and a great journey ahead. Uh, and I feel very privileged. You know, there'll be a few people along the way that says, oh, how could you possibly leave Drum Workshop? Well, I have my reasons. There's more reasons than that, but it certainly isn't their product. It isn't the fact that John Good is the Steve Jobs of drums, one of the most uh, amazing builders and innovators of our time. Garrison, the head of A&R over there, and all the builders and painters, great people. Nothing bad to say about anybody. Just time for something fresh. And that opens a spot, like I said, for somebody else to come in and have at it. I take my spot. And good luck to you. Have a great career with it. So I'll be back in about a week with a new video, unboxing and talking about my new partnership, talking about my new gear and the excitement I have for it, playing a little bit. I'm not really, I don't have anything mic'd up, so it's just raw right through the mic right there. So I can't do that. <laughs> It'll blow the thing right out. So I'm not going to play right now, but uh, tune in next week. Make sure to subscribe. I'm going to keep this channel going. There's going to be more drum stuff on this channel over time. Shout out to everybody that's helped me. By the way, if you haven't picked up uh, my head sticks through Big Bang Distribution or through your local drum shop, 
definitely get these. They're awesome. I'm so excited about that. I've talked about that in other videos. Take care of each other and keep rock alive. We'll